to my channel. In my latest extra large Korean style haul, I was doing a stranger's haul. <laughs> you guys are so funny. Your comments cracked me up. So here's part two. There's just so much to share and I hope you guys stick around for the clothes that I actually picked. Today what we're not gonna do is a haul on the wrong order. <laughs> Before we do that, I just wanna thank Function of Beauty for sponsoring today's video. If you guys have been here long enough, you guys know that I use Function of Beauty on my brutal hair that is no longer brutal. Functional Beauty fixed that. I've worked with them multiple times and I keep coming back because I really like it. Functional Beauty is super easy to use. All you guys have to do is go onto their website and take a quiz on what you want done to your hair. For me, I always go for volumizing, lengthening, oil control because yours is oily and should get itchy up here. I actually threw in something different this time, anti-aging. I didn't know that that was a thing. It literally takes you five seconds. It's super personalized, literally made custom for you. A different experience from generic hair care. It's all about functionality and looking aesthetic. So this time around, I called my bottle Linda because I had fake hook, j bumses, and now Linda. That's like my favorite part. I chose peach as my scent, duh. I decorated my bottles with stickers because I'm a sticker girl. Last time, I actually got purple shampoo to help with the blonde, but now it's not that blonde, in my hair. However, because it's getting colder, I'm not too concerned about color no more. I really wanted to focus on volume length because my goal is to have my hair down to my butt. There are customized hair care and treatment products. If you want to go the extra mile to boost your hair, such as customized leave-in treatment, custom hair serum, heck, they even have body wash and lotion so there's a bunch to look for if you want to save a coin and 20% off then you can use the link in my bio please know that functional beauty uses clean and high quality ingredients for your hair of course because we're talking hair 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 they never use parabens sulfates GMO toxins it's hundred percent vegan and cruelty free that's what you want to look for check it out link in my bio 20% okay so now to the haul <laughs> So this is a shirt that I got the last haul, including this one. So let's just say I'm not gonna try this one on because why? I have two of each now and I don't know what to do because the other two, they are significantly smaller around the armpits. This one, I can flap my wings and I can flap. The other one, I'm like grounded and I can't. It still doesn't fit the busticle like you want it to. Having this spread out, it still didn't work. Problem is me, but yeah. <laughs> That's the first piece. To be clear, I forgot to say, this is an extra large haul, but the sizes differ in Asia and in America. I wanted to do this haul to show you guys how extra large fits on a body type like mine, which according to a lot of you guys, we have the same shape. Oh my god. We do? Please normalize your body type. We're not all... Remember in my stranger's haul, I guess the orders were mixed up in some, so I did get the same skirt, and yes, I did pick this. I'm just a little nervous that like this still don't fit. Are you gonna cooperate? Okay, here goes all or nothing. I didn't get it on. I just realized you could see my reflection. Well, I'm wearing a diaper if you wanted to know. I'm on my monthly, that's great. Hey, it went through. Okay, I think I gained weight. I'm not even gonna lie. So I guess I'm the problem. On to the next. Here's another skirt. An extra large. It feels like a first date. Like, you just don't know if this is gonna work out or not. I have butterflies in my tummy right now. Look how cute. There's even a slit, okay? There's no squirt. So we have full on access. There's no stretch though. Some a little bit nervy. The quality, not bad. It went up. It did the way it did because I don't have an ass. So if you do have some booty back there, you might have a little struggle. But in my perspective, that's a good struggle. Wait, look. Is this gonna fit us? <laughs> Someone help me. Help me. Someone say help me. I think we can do it. Someone help me. Help me. Someone help me. You only have two arms, babe. I can't do this. I'm sweating. It's a sport. I can't do it. Oh, I did it a little bit. Okay, so this is how far I got. I feel like I could totally squeeze into this, but there's no one to help me. Help me. I'll just say it fits, because I feel better that way. <laughs> Look how cute. Oh my god, I love this skirt. I feel like there's some type of sophistication. Because it is so snug, it kind of tightens my tummy a little bit. I'm obsessed with this slit. And there is a covering so you can lift this, you know? My, my pad, my pad, you know? There's a covering underneath so you can kind of let your tummy breathe. Like this, look. But there's a shield, an apron, a curtain. You're covered. There's insurance. And look at the color. <laughs> the color is so I do that when I'm really excited. I squeal. <laughs> Highly recommend. I wear a US size eight for my bottoms. This skirt's cute. In my stranger's haul, I was like, I decided to get an extra L 
dress because I really want to try. I wasn't lying. I really did get a dress because that was the mindset I had. So I picked this dress up, an extra large. It has pearl details all around the neck with this very like Euro fabric. You know the girls in London? That's what I meant. Sorry. I, I something you'd see in London and Paris. And then it has this alignment of buttons coming down the middle, straight down and the buttons are like matte. Oh gosh, another zipper at the back. <laughs> I forgot to say the girly that I talk with for my Yes Style order, she actually watched my video and reached out about the inconvenience of my wrong order. Sadly, I'm bringing you the news that a lot of things in my order were already out of stock. I'm a little sad because I really wanted that blue dress and I don't see it. First of all, this feels so old. <laughs> Extra L. It's not gonna happen. Even this feels like a little too tight on my arms. It's very like out of my style. I feel like you guys wouldn't see me ever wear this. The thought was there, okay. <laughs> she really said Olaf. I mean, it's a cute dress. I could wear it as a sexy open back. It comes above my knee. I look like I've been put into a doll's dress and they didn't button my back. That's the vibe we're going for. I look like a housewife. I care for all the children while my husband goes out for work. Brings home the bacon. Does it spell misery? Kinda. However, that is the life I chose to live. Now if you would excuse me, I'm gonna go bake some cake. See. I don't know what I'm gonna do with these clothes. The K-pop outfit came in. We're gonna try this for the finale. I have to look like the girl who wore it. So I bought this crop top shirt. See, it's the same shirt, but the one I got was in blue. Look at this cute crop top. Plain and simple. I don't look like a Dr. Linda no more. I look more like a, a patient. <laughs> I don't know. I was just trying to see like what connected and that just stick. okay. I didn't realize how much life this brings out of me. This color. Very happy. Do I have these already? These are jeans, an extra large. Yes, we can confirm there's an XL. They have rips. Wait, this is the same jean I bought. I mean, I didn't buy. My homie stranger did. Oh my God, the zipper. <laughs> They put the zipper on backward. <laughs> we've seen this, we've done this. However, we have an inverted zipper. Glad we have this conversation. These are the exact same jeans that I tried on last time as well. I can tell that it's the same because of the tag. We liked it, we conquered it. On to the next. To get it out of the way, we also got these gym shorts last time. So. Oh, <gasps> the busty tank top. This feels like a tablecloth, but it's cute. I'm a little nervy because this looks a little small for the chesties. It fits my fist. We'll make it work. Before I put it on, I just want to mention that the back has this ribbon lacing. It can stretch. That's a plus. It took a village to put it on me, but we did it. So the good thing about this top is that you can fit it to your body. The straps are adjustable, so you can make it longer or shorter. I probably should make it longer, but um, too lazy. The cloth to this is not stretch. A bow. You do see this tightening on the tummy, which I really like. Really had to scoop and dupe my chesticles into the pockets here. That was the only way. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, they are spilling out on the side. We already know from the beginning that this was a very like busty top, right? So, okay, no shock. So this is the back. It ended up stretching really far. That's a good thing because girls with wider and thinner rib cages, you're with here, can all fit. And I said rib cages, yes. This feels very cheap, it is. The cloth is baggy here in the twins' bed. Bedroom, and then below the bedroom, a very thin piece of cloth that's not stretchable at all, so it's very non-elastic. I love the thin spaghetti straps. That's my favorite part about this top, it's just this area right here. It just flatters girls with broader shoulders. It's so minimal, but distinctive to the eye. The color, the pastel yellow, you guys know me. I love pastel yellow. It's like my second favorite color because of this. It just flatters my skin tone, in my opinion. You just have to find the right color for you. Okay, so I bought this very K-pop like skirt. It has this rip right here with this little metal ring. It has some type of stretch, so it's not like stiff. <sighs> okay. Uh-oh. Don't you guys just love it when I say uh oh? Extra large my ass. Just gotta zip it away. I feel like the zipper's gonna break. <gasps> I'm here proud to present a very tight skirt on the Linda. It kind of shows all the belly rolls in all sorts of funky ways, but I think that's what makes it very unique, so enjoy. It is tight, but it's zipped, okay? So you do see 
the tongue, tongue. I love this leg you see it has the cutout with the strip and the metal ring. So yes, it does outline my pouch because it is that tight. It's zipped, that's great and all, but I love how this is called an extra large. Feels like a size six when you squeeze it. I mean, it's cute, I'm not gonna lie. Because it's so tight on me and all the curves and dips, hips, I don't have hips. The bottom part feels like it's sitting kind of weird. It's like sticking out. It's not just like a, it's like a, that makes sense, right? Look at this. I just got a plain sweater with 1962, 1619. It's Anzio. I love this washed out denim color with the combo of this salmon color. It's very retro. It's not soft, so it's not the fuzzy kind of sweater. It's this fabric right here. It's loose and baggy, and then the bottom kind of like hangs off as well. Just a nice little sweater. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the next dress. It's a strawberry cutie patootie dress. I got extra large. So this is super comfortable. I think the most comfortable piece I've worn. Not too tight, not too loose, but if you know my haul, something always has to go wrong, huh, Linda? Small spaghetti straps. It really shows off this like minimalistic pop of the collarbone look. I don't know why. And then look at the neckline. It comes a little deep. Again, these are meant to be busty dresses. Here are the chesticles, guys. Look, no, these are meant to be dresses like this. Okay, I just wanted to be like a little bit serious. I know that a lot of people are like, Faye, you're showing way too much. And I understand that. However, I really wanted to get these dresses, even like the yellow top, the style, because when I was a lot heavier, I always wish that I was able to wear dresses like those girls. Dresses with tiny spaghetti straps that were low cut. I was too insecure for that back then. And now, I'm just like, I don't care. I wanna try, it looks cute. I've always envied girls who wore dresses with this kind of cut. Okay, anyway, back to the haul. It's too long. <laughs> I'm only five feet tall, and my boyfriend is sure and positive that I'm 4'11 when he measured me, but I, I say I'm five feet. It fits really nicely around the waist. Too long for me, it literally is above my knee. I'm gonna have to cut it myself. I'm gonna have to like figure out how to make it wearable to my height. Chop, chop, snip, snip. Nobody's gonna, gonna know. know. No. They're gonna know. Isn't it cute? It's so cute because it has these strawberries. My heart is literally melting. Who is she? She's confident even with her rolls. That's so good. The straps are still my favorite. They are adjustable. Two little strings right here that you can tie up closer, further, whatever you want, girl. It is your body. You can wear clothes how you want to. It's your body. So I got this flannel. It looks kind of funky. So for sure I wouldn't wear this button up. I would wear this like an outer jacket or outer flannel if you want to call it. More so off the shoulder. Definitely clashing with this dress so I can't really get like the full scope. I know this might sound weird but it feels like a potato sack bag. I do enjoy the color on me. Imagine I'm just wearing a tank top though. It kind of works, right? This is actually in the size large and not extra large. It's not oversized at all. I think with a cute little strapless or even just like a t-shirt underneath. It's the look. Moment of truth. It has this plaid pattern all over with this very safari khaki color and buttons all the way from the top to the bottom so you can just whip it off. That freaking hurt. Is that bleeding? Ooh, is this still? Wow, there's so much happening. I don't know what's going on. How does she wear it? How she look like? Still here. Still buttoning. Okay, got it. So. Um, oh yeah, here it is. So here's the first piece you put on. Kinda looks like pajamas, not my fault. You grab this skirt that stretches and wraps around your bottom half, right? I really can't see. Belt this on. Wait, something's wrong. This part goes... Linda figured it out. Roll it up so it's nice and tight. Clip it to the strap. And we're in this back. <laughs> I think I figured it out, but it doesn't look like the photo, but I don't, I don't know. You tell me. <laughs> um, <laughs> I don't know how I feel. This doesn't look like crawl. If I wear this out on a normal day, people will most definitely think I just scrapped on some clothes. I don't know if the skirt's supposed to be on this side or this side, but I think it's this side. However, there's this strap right here, so I don't know. Maybe it's the other way. Kind of sad that it doesn't look cute. I look like I'm about to go on a safari hunt. Pack it up. It's a little out there. Be brutally honest. Just tell me the truth. Tell me what I look like. I already know I'm not gonna wear this out in public ever. I don't think I'm even ever gonna wear this. 
I cannot take this off. I was really excited about this outfit, to be honest. It's just too much going on, and it feels like a puzzle piece that you have to solve. A for effort. I already have my Nathan mock turtleneck sweater that I wore recently on my Instagram. You guys should follow me on Instagram if you guys want to see me actually wear and style these clothes. Especially if we have similar body types, then follow me on Instagram because I really want to post more OOTDs or just like things that we can wear as big booby girls. I don't know what to do with this, but a lot of people on Instagram ask for this sweater, so stay tuned on my Instagram. Maybe I'll just give it away. With all that being said, that is the end of this video. I hope it redeemed something. I know that all the pieces I linked from my strangers haul is not present in this haul because they're all out of stock. So I apologize for that. I still hope you guys enjoyed today's video and if you guys want more hauls for big booby girls, then make sure to like. I guess that's it. If you're not subscribed, be a Linda. Lindas, have fun. Until next time, I'm sending love. Bye!